Hey everybody, I just wanted to give an update to everybody that's been kind enough to us to be worried about our dog Rocky, our German Shepherd. We took him to the vet this morning, they drew some blood, uh, we're waiting, and uh, we've got to go back at 3 o'clock, but we should know something around noontime or so today, possibly, on the blood work to see if he's what kind of infection he's got, if he does have one. Uh, and to those that don't know, last night he started dripping some blood, so he's passing some blood through his urine. And uh, we don't, of course, we don't know what's caused that. So uh, you know, I get to looking online, the first thing I start thinking about is cancer. Uh, they don't preliminarily, they don't think that it's that. But uh, I just want to give a big thank you to those that shouted out a prayer for us during this and for him, for Rocky. And uh, just wanted to thank everybody that thought enough about that. Um, those are the people that do things like that. They're the ones that you know who are definitely real. And uh, we appreciate you. Uh, other people, you know, there's a lot of people, they don't see these things, so they don't know uh, what's going on. So nothing against anybody, but uh, he's kind of feeling fine. He threw up this morning, but I mean, that's not totally uncommon. He'll throw up here or there. You know, he's a dog. And, uh, but... Uh, it, we're gonna they're gonna do an ultrasound we got to take him back across I already paid for it but they're gonna do a ultrasound to him and thank goodness here I mean in the United States this would cost a fortune here it does cost just a little bit so I'm thankful to God that we are able to pay for it it's not a huge huge issue but uh, money's tight everywhere, and it is with us, but thank God we're able to afford that. So it's got me and Joe pretty tore up. We love Rocky very much, so it's got us tore up. So uh, we want to thank everybody that uh, showed an interest in the next video I do. I'll... Uh, do an update on whatever they may be able to tell us or what's going on. Um, he was dripping. Now, I don't know, I have no other way to vividly explain that without grossing women and small children that maybe watch us. So I won't get so vivid in the description, but he was drip, he's been dripping for, I don't know, maybe a couple of weeks, two or three weeks, but uh, I didn't think much of it because we've had where that's happened before, and I'd take him to the vet, and they're, oh, well, just keep wiping his tushy and whatnot uh, for a while, and uh, I think I need to do that more, but... Uh, I should have took him on from day one because if something's really bad and wrong with him, I would have wished I did. So, uh, you know, all that's playing on my mind. It's got me and Joe bummed out a lot and worried, but we feel better that we went earlier, but we've got to talk to this other veterinarian doctor this afternoon that's going to do the ultrasound on him and Hopefully we'll have a lot more answers. We really love Rocky. Uh, and it's a big part of our family. And uh, it's difficult. It's difficult. Uh, people that, there's some people, they think they got big hearts, but they don't understand things like this. And I would say they don't have big hearts at all. Uh, 
you know, God put these animals on here for a reason. Uh, he didn't put them on this earth for us to use or abuse up. Uh, uh, he put, put them here uh, to help us, for it helps to us. And uh, since time immemorial, man has had dogs and cats as pets, and they've loved them very much. At least decent men have. Uh, you draw into that what you choose you will. That makes me no mind. Uh, but uh, we love animals. We love the environment. We're not tree huggers. We know man has to live. And man is first and man is separated from the animals. But we sure do love our animals. Uh, so I just wanted to say that to, uh, to people that may not really understand us or where we're coming from. So folks will know where we're coming from. We love the little animals, and uh, we will continue to do so. And we don't hold people that don't love animals in much of any type of high regard at all. So uh, I'll just leave that at that. So to everybody, thank you for praying and the wonderful thoughts and uh, the few you be that have thought enough of us to uh, leave us a kind word. Uh, e even people that aren't big prayers have said, hey, we threw one up for you anyway. And we love you and we appreciate you for that. So uh, Maybe later today I'll be able to put another video up. Joe's not going to do two workouts today. He's going to wait and do one when we come back or start one at six o'clock we got a lot of work to do there uh, uh, we're, we're going to be going into some other things and training that uh, y'all know me i've got a method and first it's building is about as much strength as you're ever gonna have and and then getting more technical and right now we're going to be working on our defense footwork uh, movements in general combinations and things like that I would stress if you see Joe hitting a bag do not think that what you are seeing is what we do As hence I put on there what he does to build power and if you go back and you look at anybody from Muhammad Ali to uh, Mike Tyson to George Foreman to Sonny Liston to Floyd Patterson to Joe Lewis to Rocky Marciano. Uh, you see these guys, they don't look like they have good technique either. That should tell you you were in new school and uh, you some different things out there young folks and uh, uh, when he when I put up a video of where he's hitting a bag he is hitting a bag to build strength not to work on technique not of anything that you were seeing so I want to stress that with you so uh, but I'm going to center this in on Rocky. I don't know why I got off on boxing. To hell with boxing right now. To hell with it. Uh, we're worried about Rocky and we'll get him straightened out. We'll move forward and not one moment before will we move forward. So that's where we are right now. And we're going to deal with him and the issue he's got. Hopefully he'll be okay. Hopefully this ain't nothing. You know, a little infection antibiotics and cleared up so that's what we're hoping for so thanks everybody